<laughs> That's the one question. Um, so... Uh, challenges, I think. Um... The challenge is how do we make quality games? How do we stay cutting edge? Yeah, you, you have to be prepared to, to, to always be in constant change and evolution. We have to create uh, things uh, the best way possible. Making it user-friendly and, so, and, and it's, so that it's not as tedious for the user to, to do the work. Communicating between all of the, dis the disciplines day to day. Um, being able to sort of spread yourself across all aspects, some of which you might not have too much information about, but you can be that sort of liaison, that sort of go between between the code and the design, the art. You have to have an understanding of what goes on, how issues affect the game, and then effectively communicating that with the rest of the team. And also be challenging to sort of, you know, take an idea and a 2D concept and sort of bring that into 3D. I think I'm my own biggest critique. In this instance, just because I'd like to try and make sure that everyone's happy. Quite a task in itself, because you've got to balance making things look quite cool, but then also making it work. Try not to waste time. You can end up doing things over and over if you don't plan it right. There's a lot to focus on. It's very easy to focus on the shiny thing that seems cool. I think it's very easy to work on the fun stuff. Um, but a lot of times it's behind the scenes, it's the things that if you don't see every day, it actually makes the biggest difference to the, to the game, to the team.